My name's Nick Fury, and this is Goose, but you can call me Fury. Rodney Spill here, and today we're going to do Marvel's Legends series, Captain Marvel, Nick Fury. First, we'll take a look at the package. Here is Nick Fury. This comes with Goose the Cat. He comes with a gun and part of the Kree Sentry. And there is the Builder figure Kree Sentry, the Legend series figure. We got this on clearance at Target. There's Goose. He's got his hand, his front paws, his back paws chained up. He's got a mouth guard on. And there is Nick Fury. All right, there's a picture of Nick Fury with both eyes. There he is again. And on the back, if you want to read that, pause that right there. Pause it now, and you can read that in Marvel Legends series, Nick Fury. Build a figure, Kree Sentry. You've got Captain Marvel, Nick Fury, Talos, Captain Marvel, Yon Rog, Marvel's Grey Gargoyle, and... Jens Vell, whatever that is. All right, now let's get this guy and cat out of the package and review them. And here is Nick Fury right out of the box. But first, we'll take a look at Goose. Here is the Goose figure. She has the uh, the mask on, the mouth guard. Her little or his little front paws are handcuffed, and the back are handcuffed. And he's got a little tuft right here where Nick Fury can grab him and hold him like that. And that is Goose, the real star of the Captain Marvel movie. Next we have Nick's little gun. Just a small little gun. It's got some kind of detailing on it. Molded in black plastic. That's about all you can say about that. <clears throat> and this is a Cree Sentry, which I'm not sure what that is. But, let's see, and this, let's see, you can move the elbow, uh, you can move the hand, this goes back and forth, and this would be, I guess, the shoulder joint. But, I guess that's all for that. <clears throat> now for Nick Fury. First, we'll take a look at the head sculpt. And it is Nick Fury with two eyes. It is a younger Samuel Jackson. He's got the white shirt, the gray tie. He's got a let's see. He's got a black suit. Let's see his tie. You can move. It's just plastic. Uh, the suit. Let's see he's got a gun holster there, and he's got another gun holster there. Oh, and you know what? Can you take his uh? Let's, oh wow, you can take his jacket off. And there's Nick Fury without his jacket on. <laughs> Even though he's got a white shirt with black sleeves, so it's kind of not supposed to be taken off because he kind of looks funny. But there is Nick Fury. You can see one gun holster there. You can see some more magazines there. And the back, it's got some little detail on the straps. All right, down his arm, he's got his suit arm. Down the legs, not much you can do about a black suit, make it a little texture. Uh, it's got the holes in the feet for a term I call playability. And that, not much to say about Nick. Now, articulation, he can look up, and he can look down, and he can look all around. Now, these are the $20 price point Legend series. <clears throat> which compared to the DC multiverse figures on the DC side which we'll show you in a minute alright arms 360 and this one clicks to the different ones he's got a upper arm swivel elbow is it double? yeah double elbow which is nice it's always nice to have a double elbow uh, no elbow swivel do the double joint and wrist swivel and wrist back and forth other arm same thing uh, it clicks uh, upper arm rotation again a double elbow which is pretty cool and the wrist movement 
Uh, he's got the, what I call a diaphragm crunch right there, or ab crunch. You can go back that far. You're going to go that far and forward. Uh, he's got waist articulation, 360 degrees. Front leg, uh, up about that much. Back, not at all. Out, almost that much. He's got an upper thigh rotation. I don't know how you're going to move your upper thigh like that, but still pretty cool. And again, double knee bend. I like that. These Marvel figures are pretty cool. The double knee bend. And you've got little foot action. Ankle tilt. Ankle rotation. And that is Nick Fury. Now let's put his jacket back on. So we can do some comparisons. So Nick doesn't look completely out of touch with two black sleeves. And, uh... Alright. Oh, and one more thing. You can have him hold... My son did this. He's got a little handle. There you go. Wait. And here is Nick Fury holding Goose, the cat, up by the tuft of hair. And then you can put the other gun in his hand. So now, there's your Nick Fury with Goose, the cat. Okay, now for some comparisons. First, we're going to bring in Captain Marvel Basic 6-inch figure. Now, this is from uh, Endgame, but that's a basic 6-inch figure where there is no knee articulation, no hand articulation, or no waist, but just uh, Marvel's Basic. And then here is Doctor Strange from Infinity War. And then we'll bring in Shazam Basic 6-inch. Now, the Basic 6-inch of DC does have knee bend, waist bend, and wrist, which the basic 6-inch don't. But this would be DC's comparison. You have Legend Series Marvel, and you have DC Multiverse. Now, the Multiverse figures are the same thing with the double bend, the ankles, the diaphragm. So these are pretty comparable. But one's DC Le or DC Multiverse and one's Marvel Legends series. So that is the $20 price point. Alright, I hope you like this review. Please check out all my other reviews. Please subscribe, turn on those notification buttons. Anytime we do a new video, you'll see it pop up. We do DC, we do Marvel, we do Transformers, uh, we do Legos, we do movie reviews, we do new toy sightings, we do a lot of stuff. Alright, Rodimus Bill. Saying, uh, Avengers Assemble. Rodimus Bill out.